According to this year's Gallup survey, 30% of Americans are engaged at work. That's one out of three employees that are engaged. Now, what do you mean by engagement? Is it that they do their job? Well, it's beyond that. It's, it's, it's bringing the energy of like really giving their best, being mentally tuned in and emotionally charged by what they do. In essence, that's two out of three people that are showing up and that, to take space to say, hey, guess what? It's Wednesday, it's hump day, and, and oh, thank God it's Friday, right? I mean, and, and dread the Monday. Where did, that, where did this culture come from? Or where did this mindset come from? People may ask, is it a systems problem? Is it a personnel problem? Is it that we have the wrong people on the bus? Is it an overall culture problem? Well, one of the interesting points that I learned not too long ago is that if you change the systems in the organization, you say, okay, here's a strategy that we're going to employ, and here's how we're going to go about doing something, and, and here's some new protocol that we're, we're going to utilize to get this outcome that we want to drive. What they found is, is that the culture will always pull back whatever it is that you change. It's like the culture, the culture of the organization operates like a gravitational pull to specifically whatever it is that you're driving in response to change. So you've got to change at the root, the culture of the organization. So where do you start this? Well, the way I look at it is you need to start this not only with the CEO, but also with the executive team. So the executive team really sets the tone and, and the movement of the organization. And everything else will resonate and will follow.